okay? Just for you. Uh, just one more question. Yes. Uh, did you also... Never. <laughs> not asking you to do something, but... Yeah. Uh, did you also do the nobody version? I didn't do Zenus, I did the other guy, uh, uh, Xehanort, thank you. You know, you, first of all, I've done over 400 characters in animation, <laughs> games, and anime. So it's, it's not always on the tip of my tongue. Sometimes I'll say, you know, who did you play in blah, blah, blah? And it's like, well, that was like 20 years ago. I don't really remember. But the, my favorite ones that come up and say, can you do uh, some of the lines you did in episode 13 and blah, blah, blah? And oh. I go, first of all, I don't even remember being in blah, 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 <laughs> let alone episode 13 or any of the lines. But if you'd like to tell me what they are, I can maybe come up I, with them. Yeah, I don't think they do it after several things. I've done like three things on a professional level voice acting wise, and one was lead character in the game. And I That's cool. I, I was, awesome. Well, you're going to remember that. Yeah. And I remember there's 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 you know a bunch of them that I remember because I really love them. Yeah. But there's a lot of them that you go in and their jobs. You know, you go in and you don't always know what's going on because you do your part. You go in and you read the script and you don't know unless you direct, which I direct. I do a lot of directing. In fact, I just directed uh, Arkham Origins. Anybody yeah. like that game? I play yeah. three characters in that as well. That's a, the biggest Batman game Warner Brothers has ever done, and we recorded that on the Warner Brothers lot, and that was pretty cool. That was fun every day to go to Warner Brothers and do a Batman game on the Warner Brothers lot, where they do Batman. That was unbelievable cool. Yes, you with the fuzzy ears. <laughs> That's the only reason you're here, isn't it? Princess, didn't I kill the last guy who called me that? He should have known I am the only Joker around here. <laughs> <laughs> Joker. Yeah, that was fun. Um, that particular job was uh, really fun because they called me one day and they said, we want you to come in, and it was for Mortal, Com Mortal Kombat vs. DC Universe was the name of the game. <laughs> and they basically had me play our audition for every DC character, and then they had me audition for every Mortal Kombat character. So I booked Raiden, who's on Mortal Kombat, and I play him in all the, all the Mortal Kombat games. And I, the casting director pulled me aside because they had, they had Warner Brothers on the line and they had DC Comics on the line listening to all this stuff. And they said, who would you like to do if you got to choose one? And I said, well, I'd love to do the Joker because that was so much fun going in and doing that. And uh, so they called me the next day and said, you booked the Joker. So that was awesome. And I got to do that. And then I got to do him in Injustice, Gods Among Us, which is fighting game of the year. And then I'm doing them again in this new uh, online game series called uh, Infinite Crisis. So it's been fun, and uh, there he may just show up again. And I may show up as another Batman character, but I can't talk about that yet. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. But uh, yeah, that may come up very soon. It's fun, you know. It's really fun for me. Uh, there's a, there's a few series that, you know, like, for example, I'm part of the Transformer universe, and I, I'm in uh, uh, War for Cybertron, I play Skywarp in that, and I wrote two-thirds of Robots in Disguise and played Armor Hide in that, and Batman World is something I've always loved, and uh, now I'm just, like, really ensconced in all this Batman stuff, so it's, it's kind of cool, and I'm really enjoying that. So, it's fun. Anybody have any questions? Any answers? Yes. Okay, so it's, it's no reason for I guess to get into it, but how did you, I'm sure you've been a million times, but what drove you to wanting to be a voice actor? And Insanity. Yeah. <laughs> and then how did yeah. you, like, what was your breakthrough moment that you got your first role or started getting a headway? Well, you know, I wish I could, I, I wish it was really easy and, and you could just say, I did it X, Y, and Z, but that's really not the way it happens, happened for me and not the way it happens for most people. Uh, the way it happened for me was I trained and am an actor and I went to Los Angeles to do on-camera work, which I still do. And I, in fact, I'm in a, in a movie called Broken Spirits, which hopefully is going to be coming out next year, we hope, God willing. Um, but uh, yeah, I still do a lot of stuff. I was in a lot of soap operas. I did a lot of TV shows and did guest star stuff and uh, sitcoms and all that crap. So, uh, I mean, all, the, all that fine programming. Um, and. Uh, 
I kind of fell into the voice thing originally. Uh, my wife, who uh, you may have met at the uh, opening ceremonies, uh, was in some.